Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the Airlaw Champions Cup. First big night of the whole event. It is me, your boy, of course, you know who I am, but I'm not alone today. Uh, I am joined by the man, the myth, the legend, uh, who is incredibly allergic to winning races, Pyro. Say hello to Pyro chat. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Please be mindful oh, that, of his condition. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was uncomfortable. That, that's how we're starting it. That, okay, I see it. I see it. I see how we're doing this. <laughs> Just now, get, hello, everyone. getting it's, yourself uh... to a good start. <laughs> it's oh. off to a good start already. Yeah. Uh, mm. Yeah, it's just one of those, I don't understand how I haven't won a race since season eight, but it is what it is. It do be like um, that. But yeah, I'm looking forward to this. Yes. I'm looking so very forward to this. Tonight is actually not about us. Well, actually partially about you, because you are one of the captains, but we'll get to that. Uh, if you guys do not know, uh, but I'm sure you do know, this is the ALR Champions Cup. This is the special event that's going to be happening in the next off-season, where uh, the teams, instead of instead of being allocated to countries how it was before with the Nations Cup, teams are actually going to be picked. And today we are starting the whole process of how the teams are going to be picked. So we have 12 captains representing 12 teams. Uh, and today we are first going to be um, setting the draft order. So doing the draft lottery, how it's going to go down. We're going to get to that in a second. And we are also going to be doing the group seedings. So today is the start of a very big thing that's going to be happening in a couple of weeks. But today uh, we are going to be setting the order of how uh, the our captains are going to be picking their teams a little bit later on. So yeah, we're going to be starting with the draft lottery, uh, which is essentially uh, a smart, well, I, I hope it is smart, uh, way uh, of choosing who's going to be uh, picking drivers in what order. So um, we have, how many do we have? Like 48 total drivers? Uh, so it's going to be teams of four, uh, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I believe so. Yeah, it's so it's a captain plus, plus three drivers. Yeah. So uh, there will be 36 drivers that are picked through the draft. And today uh, we are going to be setting the first 12, the order of the first 12 picks because, because for the other rounds, sort of around number two and three of the actual draft, a little bit later on uh, in the month, uh, the order of the draft is actually going to be reversed. So if you're picking number one in round number one, you're going to be picking last in round number two. So uh, today uh, we are going to be setting only the first 12 picks randomly, sort of randomly, uh, but it is also going to set the order for rounds number two and three. You will see that on the screen later on. It'll be fine. You'll figure it out. Hopefully we figure it out. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, and in terms of group seedings, uh, in comparison to um, Nations Cup, when we were racing all against each other in the qualifying stages, the qualifying stage is replaced with a group stage uh, in the Champions Cup. So the idea is that the 12 teams are going to be split into four groups, and then they will qualify from these groups into the semifinals. So we also need to set the groups, basically. We need to find out wh which group is going to be the group of death. Who's going to be absolutely demolished because they ended up in a group with uh, three of the strongest teams. Well, we don't know the teams yet, but, you know, if, if there's a potential for uh, some groups of death. So this is the plan for today. Uh, hopefully you all are looking forward to this because we definitely are. Uh, by the way, if you're watching this live, uh, there was a gambling. Oh, I shouldn't say gambling. There was a prediction happening uh, before on whether the uh, Falcon team is going to get the number one overall pick. And that is the question because there are different chances of teams uh, getting the number one overall pick. And this is actually what we're going to uh, move on to next. Uh, here are the draft odds. Do you want to explain how they came about, Pyro? Should I do it? <laughs> <laughs> well, you're the one, well, I believe you and Otto came up with, yes. the, uh, uh, with the odds. Am I right? Um, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so... If you want to explain how the I actual can. formula works, yes. Uh, we so can go from there. essentially, we have twelve captains. These captains are drivers in ALR, and uh, ALR has an ELO system, a ranking system. So each driver in Gran Turismo Seven, I'm pretty sure it's the case for other games as well, but we're talking about Gran Turismo Seven. Uh, each driver has certain rating assigned to them, and because we have um, captains of different levels, in order to make um, 
the draft process, the team's a little bit more balanced, a tiny bit more balanced, you know. Uh, there's always going to be another it's Italy team. It's it's inevitable. Uh, or Europe. Um, we have different chances for the teams to land a higher pick because what does a higher pick mean? It means a better potentially driver for you to draft. So uh, we have taken the uh, rankings of all the captains and put them in the special formula that basically works in a way that the faster you are as a captain, the lower your chances are to get the number one overall pick. So you, as you can see there on the screen, uh, Cap, uh, representing Mobile One, has 1.4% chance of landing the number one overall pick. Uh, and on the other side, Frackers being, quote-unquote, the slowest, the lowest-ranked captain uh, of this selection, has the highest overall um, chances of 16.2% of landing uh, the number one pick, but it's actually not as easy because, uh, yes, you have the higher chance of getting the number one overall pick, but it's not guaranteed by any means because if we look at the top four uh, in terms of chances of a number one pick, uh, you've got Auto right behind on 15.2%, uh, Charizard in third, well, projected third with 14.1%, and Gunmad in fourth with 13.3%. So all that top or bottom four, it depends on how you want to look at it. They have, I want to say, like almost identical chances of, of getting the number one overall pick. But uh, my question is, actually for you, Pyro, because you are one of the captains here, uh, sitting at projected fifth pick at 9.7%. Like, what would be your ideal drafting position? Because obviously, if you get the number one overall pick, you do get a chance of drafting the best available driver. But then you're waiting all the way to pick number 24. So would you actually want the number one overall pick or what would you be like, would you be more happy with some sort of different uh, picking order for you? Um, of course, getting number one pick would be great. Like that, that's just a guaranteed driver. You know, it's going to hit it off the, uh, hit the ball every mm -hmm. single time for a home run. That's, that's usually how this, that works. Yeah. Um, but, there are a significant amount of people who are based in tier one in this league, high tier two, for example, uh, that are still that are on the board that we can pick from. So yeah. even if I went maybe even the fifth, as I'm predicted to go in the yeah. odds, um, I wouldn't be complaining. That might give me someone like Slim, for example, right. who I've, I've raced with a few times by now, and I know he can do a job whenever he can, whenever he's uh, asked to do a job, and he's, he's yeah. quick on his own in his own right and all that. So. There's, a, there's an advantage to going first. Yeah. But it's a case of what's left at 24. Definitely. <laughs> which definitely. is a bit scary. Absolutely, yeah. In, in my experience, I actually... So, obviously, a very fast driver will get you to the semifinals guaranteed, maybe even to the finals guaranteed. We've seen it before with other teams. But if... What was it? If, I think it was the second Nations Cup where Canada won. And no offense to Canada, it's actually a good thing. But it was the most mid team you can imagine not in the way that all of them are bad but like it wasn't the team that anyone actually saw winning the whole thing and what you get is that you just want a very solid average team rather than maybe having one very good driver and the rest of the team that doesn't really support them in a way so yes number one pick is great you're almost guaranteeing yourself uh a trip to the finals but is is it enough to win the whole thing? Because this 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 championship, this event is basically um, uh, nations cup. So the system is exactly the same. So you you do really want uh, the best average team you can get. But the the thing is now is that the captains are actually in control of getting that team as much as they can be, obviously with their draft order. So yeah, my question to you. Uh, is that, well, me and you, we ran a few simulations of this uh, drafting, lo draft lottery process just to be sure that it works. Uh, do you actually yeah. think Falcon is going to go number one? Absolutely not. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I've been using the, uh, the, the reference of your day. Anybody who pays attention to the NBA will know this kind of system by now. And um, anyone who's yeah. paying to the, uh, attention to the last NBA one will know how the uh, Detroit Pistons got absolutely screwed out of yes. one number one pick on the last one. And I fully, fully, fully expect something similar to happen here. Wouldn't yes. even surprise me if Rackers didn't even get a top three pick. Yes, yeah. It's just because, yes, 16.2 is the highest percentage of all the others available, but it's still less than one-fifth of the actual, like, wheel in order to get the number one pick so yeah the chances are high 
but by no means guaranteed. I'm just hoping that Cap doesn't get the number one overall pick because we are <laughs> going to get crucified for that. There's like I can give any explanation behind the formula that was used to calculate the odds. Anyone would just say that it's rigged. We don't care. <laughs> Everything is bought. <laughs> Yeah, uh, to answer a couple of questions from the, from chat right now. Yeah. Uh, is there a menu of the 36 driver to pick? There is. It's in, if you're paying attention to the event channel, which we've been keeping the captains in at this point, uh, there's a subthread that has a list of every single person who's put themselves down and they're eligible to go into the draft. Uh, I updated it earlier. I put all their tiers on to help people do a little less scouting, I, I guess. Um, but yeah, that... that You've got all that. You can go and take a look at that, but that didn't really come into effect till we've done this. Because yes. this comes first. Yeah. You then know what you're going to be picking at, and you can build your board off that. Definitely. Because if you're picking like 10th, you are not, like, there's no point of putting BX on your list. It's not going to happen. It's not dropping all the way to 10th. So, yeah. Uh, captains could already start looking at people who they could potentially pick, but what really matters is this, because now we're going to know what what are the captain's chances of getting the higher place driver? So I think uh, we should just move on to the actual draft lottery. So uh, welcome everyone to the draft lottery screen. This is what it looks like. Uh, so this is the wheel. As you can see, for example, there's mobile one uh, represented by cap with a very tiny line. Uh, that is representative of those 1.4% chances of uh, Cap getting the number one overall pick. So due to the limitations of the formula, we're going to lose a little bit of excitement here. We're actually going to start with the number one pick and work our way down. So uh, once the team is picked, I'm going to update the list on the right. So whatever team gets the number one overall pick, they're also going to get the pick 24 and pick 25 and so on and so on. So I will update that as we go. Uh, I will ask for a little bit of patience on that because it doesn't happen immediately, but it's, it's not going to take a long time. Uh, but yeah, I think if everyone is ready, uh, we can see uh, who is actually going to get the number one overall pick here. Yeah, is that, uh, that prediction done before we get started? Yes. Oh, by the, by the <laughs> way, everyone, I will, I will try. So after each spin, obviously I will remove the team that, that gets picked and I will reshuffle the wheel just to make it as uh objective as fair as possible just so everybody knows that we're not rigging it there's no point in rigging it unless pyro gets number one overall pick that is definitely right <laughs> if, if I, I hope everyone has rigged already typed in the chat for the set the nanosecond the yokohama lands the number one overall pick i i expect nothing less from everyone okay i think there's no winning here there's no definitely, winning here definitely definitely yeah if, if, if it goes as to form, we're gonna get it's gonna get slated as a pick. So if I get yes. number one pick, I'm gonna get pitchforked out the stream. Yes, most definitely. <laughs> All right, so I think uh, we are good to go. Let's reshuffle the wheel to make it fair, uh, and this is the moment of truth. Let's spin the wheel to see who is gonna be picking number one in the Champions Cup uh, draft. Let's go. All right, let's go. Who's gonna get it? Who's gonna? Let's see, is Falcon going to be that team? Oh, this is a good one. It might be. It might be. It's a bit far away, but it might be. Oh, no, it's not. It's definitely not. It's rolling past it. Oh, or is it? Or is it? Or is it? It's close. Oh, it's past it's it. Not, it's not it's Falcon. Not. It's Hellfight Stars. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. What? Alpine what? Stars. Was projected CMP. to what? go number eight from eighth to first. From eighth to first, this is this is something else. Well, CMP has got the one pick. This is <laughs> generational. This is truly generational. <sighs> oh, oh my god! We d we did well, see. Who put money on? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You guys, yeah. There was a lot of coins. Bet on the uh, on the Falcon not getting number one overall pick, so you are safe. Congratulations! <laughs> oh man! Oh god! CMP going first. We're it... all screwed. <laughs> yes, <laughs> most definitely. We are all one hundred percent screwed. <laughs> oh no! Okay, let me update the list. Alpine stars. 
uh, going number one, number 24, uh, and number 25. And as Tab mentioned, we have seen, uh, we have seen uh, CMP and BX race together quite a, a lot of times, to be honest, in, in Monday races. Um, at least in my time, I do remember them racing together quite a bit. So this could be one of the strongest teams. But again, we do need to remember that it is the first pick, but then all the way till pick 24. And in my, in my opinion, in my honest opinion, it's not the number one pick that's going to matter. It's not your round one pick that's going to matter. It's all the other ones, because these are the picks that will make the biggest difference to your team compared to others. How well you're going to pick those lower rated drivers that people often overlook. Yeah, that is entirely true. Uh, but having a tier one driver as captain CMP, obviously the one that gets the first pick, uh, yeah. who is rather unfortunate on a Monday. But yes. When it comes to these kind of things, usually hits it. And pairing him with arguably one of the best drivers in the league Yes. That that's probably a hard that, that that's got to put in favorites. Yes, definitely. <laughs> the definitely. absolute least. <laughs> Absolutely. Yes. Yes. All right. Oh, that's going to be a hard team to beat. Definitely. Most definitely. Th this one's going to be scary. 100%. Okay, let's remove Alpine Stars from the selection. Uh, obviously for the teams that were supposed to go high, so the teams like Falcon, Fanatec, Bilstein, Enios, uh, their chances of getting the next big pick, pick increase massively now with the other team being gone uh so i think uh it is time for the second pick let's go now ideally it would be one of those top four teams but you never know we, we might be getting cap at pick number two and this thing is meaningless now <laughs> <laughs> it just turned into how many how many people could get absolutely destroyed okay it's probably fanatec it's lo it looks like fanatec to me yes there yeah, we go right. so that's right. that's actually that's actually a jump up so fanatic was projected to go number three they did go number two uh so that is a small jump but still around where they were supposed to be uh who's actually the captain for fanatic is it um charizard charizard okay charizard. number two pick it's not bad nice that is a vast difference between one and two. <laughs> yes. yes. <laughs> uh, the real question is, who is Char we all know, realistically, we can all put a number to who, or a name to who CMP is probably thinking of right now. De most definitely, yes. Yeah. But who is Charizard thinking of right now? That's the, big, that's the bigger question Yes. in all of this. Because if you take away BX, I mean, next one in is probably you. You're probably the maybe, next maybe. Um, we'll see what we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what Charizard thinking in yeah, a couple of weeks' time. Definitely, we are getting to a point where uh, it, it is getting quite difficult to draft because the lower you go in the first round, you are getting further away from the obvious early picks, like people like BX, uh, for example. And then it's getting to a point where you do need to pick the fastest driver available, but it's not that obvious. So it's not going to be one of those obvious top level aliens. So you do need to think a little bit more about your pick. You do need to do a, a lot more research, I think. Okay, uh, with Fanatec out of the way, uh, there we go. All right, pick number three. Let's see where this one's going, because we've had two. We've had the opposite ends of the spectrum already. So uh, far, all the teams so... are going up. So far, it's 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 up from now. For now. Oh, this is looking like Enios to me. Unless a surprise Penzoil. Or maybe Sparko. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> this is so rigged. Penzoil. This is so rigged. Oh, it's Capel. <laughs> There's no three. way. There's no way we get CMP and Capel picking in the top three. This is this has got to be illegal. I've got to be rigging it at this point. Penzoil jumping up from tenth to third, tenth to third. Oh God, eighth to first, tenth to third. Oh no. <laughs> uh... All I'm gonna say is for those, I I just 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 praying. 
Yes. Th those two get drawn in the same group, and I'm not in it too. <laughs> yes, yes. This is going to be a very strong group if these end up together, 100%. <laughs> Oh god, I feel sorry for Fracas, for Gun Mad, and for uh, Auto right now because they've gone from one, what, one, three, and uh, one, two, and four, and yep. well, the only person that can actually get their predicted draft picks at this point in time through the first four is Gun Mad, who would yep. have to go four. Yeah. So... If, if I if I'm if I'm Fracas, if I'm Auto, I'm really nervous right now because you are projected to go top four. We are already three picks down, and you're not even there yet. I, we, you, I, you t technically, statistically, you could be looking at like a bottom half of round one, and you were projected to go up top. Like this is this is a really, I, I don't think it like it's gonna make the event, the championship, a lot worse or a lot more difficult. It's just a matter of now you've got to worry about your picks a lot more, because you can't just go for the obvious pick. You've got to worry about who you're actually picking a lot more in the first round it brings in a lot more in terms of a margin for error because yes. yeah everyone knows about the top guys in the league yeah. but when you when you go down and you have to make a judgment call or these guys are similar pace who am i going with yeah um yeah. you can make a mistake yeah uh, you can get that that 50 50 wrong for example and definitely it, it brings a lot more into it and uh, we've seen people with bad strategies before there's always one sick boy who was funny enough yes, high captain yeah. in this draw that's uh, arguably the most infamous uh, yeah. example of getting a strategy wrong. So definitely, yeah. yeah. We'll wait and see. And you, like, you're looking with, with with drivers like BX. You are looking at a complete package. This is the driver that's going to do everything for you. You can like it doesn't matter. They don't have weaknesses. They will deliver. But now in these quote unquote lower picks, you're getting to a point where you're picking on smaller things like is this driver better on tires than the other one? Is are they more consistent? Are they better with these cars compared to these cars? Because obviously CMP is a captain, so I'm just going to use him as an example. Uh, CMP is an absolute monster when it's not Group 3 cars. He is very fast in Group 3 cars, but as soon as he gets put into something else, absolute machine. So these are the things that you've got to look at, because obviously Nations Cup and the Champions Cup, they every single race is a different car. So you need someone who's consistent across different cars. So these are the picks that are actually going to matter, even though they are lower down. Also, on that note, don't forget there's a complete unknown with this entire draft, and by the time we hit draft night, we will know know about it, obviously, because it's yeah. about five days later. But we have a physics change coming on the 25th, which will yes. affect how a large majority of these cards will function. So yes. it's a lot that you might be looking at now that might change given the fact that somebody might be quick now and somebody might just not get to grips with these new, uh, with, with punctures, for example. Definitely, Maybe yeah. bad on tire wear. Yeah, somebody who's bad on tire wear is going to struggle. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. yeah. You might have to spend most of the time on medium tires instead of softs and all yeah. of a sudden that big, big hitter you've got may not be so big anymore. Definitely. All right. Well, with three pigs down, as you can see, uh, the chances of Falcon, for example, landing the number one, the number four pick, are uh, it's about twenty five percent, just under twenty five percent. So uh, we are getting into the very rigged territories if these teams do not go next. So with pick number four on the board, let's see the who Yokohama is going would be to be nice picking. Right now. That would be very nice. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> the Yokohama would be. I still love how Kepler Road sorry, is, uh, bar is still absolutely tiny. Oh, it might not be Falcon. It might not be Falcon again. Oh, is it? Is it Cap? No, it's not Cap. It's not Cap. It's nope. It's it's it's. Is it you? Is it you? Oh, it is it's you. Me. Hey. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'll take that. We Yokohama, from fifth we to fourth. <laughs> oh man. Somebody, quick, go uh, one of the help if you're in this stream right now. Go and change Fracas's name to the Detroit Pistons for me. Oh, no. Um... <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> to be honest, for you, that's a, like, for you as a team, that's a pretty okay pair because you were projected, Yokohama was projected to go fifth, now fourth. That's reasonable. That's reasonable. That's a very good jump up, if you ask me. Picking fourth, very good place. I will take that. We might be still in territory of a very obvious driver, but uh, 
it's gonna be pretty nice going through going through the lists knowing that i i can put four people down and i know i will get one of them yes yeah yeah oh man this this is not looking good for those top teams we are so so we saw before the projected top four there are none of them at the moment we are four picks down they're not there they're absolutely <laughs> not Actually, there no that's what there's one there's one. Oh, there's fan attack i'm sorry fan yes yes fan, fan, fan attack is the one yes and they still jumped up so they were projected to go third they they went second so so far we're looking at a pretty much like flipped uh draft order like the projected draft order all the teams for now are going up from their projected position right let's go to pick number five it's, it's gotta be one of those it's going to be one of those where those who expected a high draft pick are going to be disappointed yep. right about now. And pick number five goes to you. Surely. Falcon. Surely it's finally. Finally. Idiots. Congratulations. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Fracas. I'm I actually, congratulations. Top five pick. Very solid. Very obviously not the first one, but very solid. Falcon with the number five <laughs> I just overall pick. To point out. I just wanted to point out. Did I or did I not tell you before this stream started that he would turn into <laughs> the Detroit Pistons? Yes. It worked out exactly the same way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Predicted first, goes fifth, and an underdog gets first pick. That, that's incredible. Absolutely. Absolutely incredible. But we are getting into the territories of those nicer picks because you're not picking too far away from those picks. So um, Falcon is looking at 5, 20, and 29, which is actually quite nice. There's like a nice middle ground in terms of when you're picking. Yeah. But, and, and, and uh, as uh, Lawhands pointed out, there might be someone very good, like one of the top drivers left left at, at the fifth pick. So it's not all lost. It's definitely not all lost by any means. Okay, now with Falcon out of the way, look at the chances of Billstein <laughs> landing the <laughs> number six pick. <laughs> Billstein was supposed to go second. Uh, we are at pick six, and they are, well, oh. hopefully, we're going to be there. <laughs> Also, may I just uh, point, uh, bring up the point that before we actually started this and when we did our predict, like earlier on our projections, yeah. uh, Enios got picked twice um, yes. by the thing to go first. Yeah. They're still on the board. <laughs> and you know what I just realized? And I promised people that, and I completely forgot. I forgot to shuffle the wheel after each spin. <laughs> <laughs> um. But you know oh, what? That's gonna be in the chat now. Yeah, we're not we're not gonna worry about that. You know, it's it's fine. It's not that big of a deal. We're just gonna shuffle it now six times, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Just to make it up for the previous none shuffles. All right? Yeah, it's all fair. I say it's fair. I've checked with the organizers. They say it's fair. Uh, okay. <laughs> I've checked with the organizers. <laughs> you are one of the organizers. The it does not matter. It it does not matter. Me. I do not want to hear about it. <laughs> Okay, let us spin the wheel for the pick number six. Let's go. It's got to be Bill Stein. It's got to be Bill Stein at this point. They, they've dropped too far down. Oh, this is incredible. I actually might not be them. We might be looking at a Sparko pick here. Away. It might be. It is a Sparko pick. <laughs> it is. So... An which is quite funny because that makes them, that makes Sparko the first team picking where they were actually yes. predicted to pick. Yes. <laughs> Asselda was projected to go number six. And there we go. Sparko is the first team at their designated place, basically. <laughs> oh, man. It is about time that something went to four. Yes. <laughs> uh, <laughs> unfortunately, if you're Fracas or Otto, uh you didn't want it you didn't really want it to be right about now <laughs> oh yeah this is yeah we are for those teams we are looking at a bad draft position at this point they were supposed to go top four we're looking at the bottom half of the first round now um and they're still on the board not amazing if you ask me but that's the way the cookie crumbles 
I guess you can blame me for not shuffling the wheel. I guess I guess it's it's fair. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Just saying scam. What a scam in the chat. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, sound Incredible. alerts are turned off. Yes. Um, if you guys are trying to use the sound alerts that are for my channel, I, I guess it makes sense that would work here. But I turned them off. Sorry. Uh, you can no longer scare us with that jump scare once. <laughs> All right. Let's re remove Sparko. Shuffle the wheel. Uh, and now we are starting with the second half. Um of our draft lottery prediction payout will happen later because I'm kind of busy. I'm doing things, right? You're going to get your coins yeah, later. Do it in between this and the group. Team. Yeah, they can so wait I until the end of the stream. They, they, they can be patient. <laughs> All right. Pick number seven. <laughs> Let's go. There's a, uh, there's a lot of blue, the yes. light blue and uh, the orange on this wheel right now. It's got to be Bill Stein at this point. It's got to be. They've been waiting for a long time. Would I think so, and... Yeah, there we go. Pick number seven. Slowing down. Yeah. From He's finally got off the board. It's from second. From all second the way down to, to seventh. seventh. Oh, my. That, that is auto on... Well, figuring out where he's picking now. Seven, yeah. eighteen, thirty-one. To be honest, not that bad of a position. Right in the middle, almost, together with Sparko. Uh, quite a decent position to be picking in. You'll get that. Uh, that that team, that that consistent team that you were talking about at the beginning of the uh, at the beginning of the stream. Yeah. So it it could be worse for Auto, albeit not much worse, given the fact yes. that you meant to go second. Yes, that is. That is a big ouch from second to seventh. What high... I don't want to I don't want to see Enos as uh, Enos as uh, per percentage to get the next pick now. After, yeah, after yeah. After, 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 after this get gets removed, we like look at this, people. Look at this. We remove Bill Stein. Look at that. We are looking at almost fifty percent chance of landing the number eight pick. <laughs> but we I Enos was supposed to go fourth. Uh, they they might uh, drop down to eighth, and it's not even guaranteed that they're gonna go eighth at this point. If if Gunmad somehow somehow doesn't go eighth, this would be yes. incredible. I will I I will probably have to remove myself from this position because it's obviously rigged if it doesn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> Asseldorf just put in chat saying it's gonna be mobile one. If that it, happens, it could I'm be. It could be. I'm yeah. Laughing. yeah. I'm <laughs> you will just hear me fall on the floor laughing if that yes. happens. <laughs> if I so we, we do have a few teams that are projected to go later than this, but we do have golf, for example. So Perry, a late sub in as a captain, was supposed to go number six, already dropping to at least number eight. Um Castro is fine, projected eleventh. Mobile one projected uh, last as well, and Haggerty's projected ninth, so uh, and obviously Enios, we, we're just not going to talk about it. This is uh, horror that Enios is where, still on the board. <laughs> yeah, this is the point where CMP was meant to come off the board. Yes. Um, so this is, this, is a, this is a bit of a uh, perception in kind of how this has turned out. Also, Gunman just said, I retired as captain if he'd last. <laughs> <laughs> it's the, so if you saw how I'd last. If you saw our head last after being projected fourth with like four, almost forty uh, percent, yeah, just yeah, that that's entirely fine at right, that let's point. Reshuffle the wheel, although it doesn't really matter at this point. It, it's not that big of a deal. Uh, and all right, let's go see who's going to be picking at number eight. Rack said start again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Reroll. This doesn't count. That was just a test. Oh, it might not be. It might not be. Sure. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's sure. not. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Gunman. <laughs> Perry's next. We've got golf represented by Perry uh, at number eight pick. Oh, no. <laughs> This is uh, is something else. I find, 
I thought I was taking the piss out of. And to be honest, of... I I did I did full, I did fully expect uh, the teams to go up and down. Obviously, it's going to happen because these pre percentages it's not a guarantee. People uh, teams are going to move up and down, but this 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 is something else. Uh... Bearing in mind, we have five positions, uh, four positions dropped for Falcon, five positions dropped for Bill Steed, and at the absolute minimum, five dropped for Ineos. <laughs> <laughs> Criminal, criminal activities. <laughs> oh, okay. Perry well, Perry also dropping a position there. By the way, Perry was uh, yes. predicted to go seventh. Yes, he was predicted um, to go seventh. When eighth, not that bad of a considering. It, you could have been like Enios. That's a, that's all right. Like I'm okay dropping one position instead of at least five. <laughs> oh, look, <laughs> look at that percentage. Look at that. Okay. It's gonna be my bad one. Like, just, just pick, to pick screw number with it. number nine. Hard. Let's see if we can end gunman suffering, and finally get him, him on the boat. Even with a shuffled wheel, it doesn't move Enios at all. <laughs> no, Pyro, it's not Enios again. This is this can't be real. <laughs> or is it? Is it? Hold on. It, it's it's rolling. It's rolling. Going back round. It's no. Not. No. It's not. No. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> Which means uh, Jill's has gone up two positions. Yes, there. from eleventh uh, to ninth. Can manage the bottom three picks after being predicted to go four. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Gunman man in the chat. <laughs> You will be receiving oh. uh, moral compensation from us officially. <laughs> I'm very sorry that it happened to you. This is what this is what men try for. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am dying laughing right now. Oh, almost a tear in my eye at this point. This is something. Uh, yes. This is incredible. Bearing in mind, there's two of the three left on this point. There is no position where Kep can be lower than his prediction. The other two are guaranteed to be lower than where they were predicted yes. on the odds. Yes. Uh, but before we continue, oh. uh, let's let's quickly pay attention to the uh, chances of Enios now that apparently do not mean a single thing. <laughs> look look at that. Oh my god, it's look. 68%. <laughs> it's almost a quarter of a wheel. <laughs> I've, been, uh, I've been told to read the uh, chat before okay. we spit again. All right, let's, let's, let's look at that. Read GT chat before um, what's been said. Oh, okay. Gun mad. This wheel is sponsored by <laughs> Hammers UK. <laughs> oh. For those who don't get that reference or haven't seen uh, the actual steward things, uh, Hammers basically pulled a Sonic mm. on, on Gun Mad. Um, <laughs> that, that's the law behind that. Uh, that that's a world class comment there. Okay, well, let's sh shuffle incredible. the wheel just to be sure <laughs> that it may be changes what something. The shuffling? <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, it, it moved Danny us around. Yeah, we are getting somewhere. All right, all right. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna pay out the predictions uh, because I want to do another one. I want to do the prediction of whether Enios is actually gonna go <laughs> a tenth. I'm gonna pay it out. Uh, I don't know how how to do it. Um, we're actually gonna go to. Uh, this screen for a second because I need to open something on the other screen uh, to pay out the prediction because we we need another one uh, we need another at this God point Gunnar thinks, thinks he'll be eleventh oh man I love how you've gone back to the pick on screen as if it's not to rub it in Gunnar oh yes yeah, sorry <laughs> sorry <laughs> I did I didn't mean it okay uh. Start a prediction. This has got to feel like a personal attack at this point. <laughs> Will Enios actually go 10th? Uh, I can't believe this. Godman would, would have come into this thinking, yeah, I might be set. I might go 5th. Well, that might be the lowest I'll go. And um, I'll, I'll, put, I'll get my board ready based off of that. And he's just sat here. And he still yep. hasn't been picked. <laughs> yep. Okay, there we go. A prediction is up for one minute. If you have any um, uh, channel channel like points, 
uh, please predict now. You've got less than a minute to put your predictions in. Uh, of is it gonna uh, it, is if... it gonna be sixty eight percent for uh, Enios, yeah. the twenty five percent for Haggerty, or the seven percent for Mobile One? Yeah, <laughs> Th this is where Alto is gonna make his money because this man is a king of predictions. There's currently whatever Alto does <laughs> immediately. Uh... <laughs> There's currently eleven and a half thousand coins on Enios actually going tenth, and one hundred and forty on Enios not going tenth. Okay, six hundred sixty now. Oh, okay. All right, I less than 30 seconds. I, I, I see a lot of twos. Oh, oh put 10k on. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, okay. Also, yes. Asodar saying, me and you, duality of man, I'm guessing that's because <laughs> I just sat here dying. You're yes. sat here oh, uh, completely apologetic. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right. All right, I think we're ready to go. The prediction is over. This is the moment of truth. I think Gun, is he still Yeah, he is still here. Okay. Uh, <laughs> poor man this is torture yeah. at this point <laughs> yes I, I i would be i i would not want to watch this like if i was gunman i, I, would, I would just turn I it would, off if i was gunman i would i would have gone at the after six like yeah, that, yeah. that point it was okay <laughs> all right that point uh, way too way too late oh we're good to go uh, let's go pick number 10 yeah, is enios gonna finally gonna be free from this torture chamber let's go <laughs> For for the for, for the laughs, I hope not. <laughs> Sorry, gun mad, but I hope not. I had a lot. I had a lot. No, no, it's got, it's got it, 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 it's got it. Yes, yes, there we go. That yeah, was close. Yeah. It wasn't as comfortable <laughs> as it could have been, but there we go. Congratulations, gun mad. <laughs> You've dropped from what fourth. He has dropped a yeah. grand total of six positions. There we go. Four. Congratulations. Uh, Woo! Also, well done. Everyone that, didn't, everyone that didn't follow Otto, why the hell did you not follow Otto? <laughs> <laughs> no, my gambling. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's finally get Enios on the board. A moment we've all been waiting Otto. for. I don't, I don't understand how Otto is getting everything right all the time. Yes, I, I don't get it. <laughs> This man's going to be a millionaire and coins are just your street at this rate. A funny thing is, I do have a special uh, prize for somebody who has 1 million channel coins. They can get banned. For 1 million channel points, you can get banned on my, cha <laughs> on my channel forever. I I I've got a feeling he's saving up for that. Okay. What? <laughs> <laughs> his gambling, dr his gambling dr skill compensates for his driving skill. <laughs> Yo. That, that's a violation. That, that's got to be a timeout in my chat. We, we do not condone that. We, we fully condone that behavior, by the way. Vikings, Vikings just got after Otto there. Uh, uh, all right, well. All of his points. But finally, uh, Enios off the board. Uh, Haggerty, actually, uh, speaking uh, of Haggerty, uh, we kind of overlooked it. It was supposed to go ninth. Actually, not that big of a drop, but yeah, it was supposed to go ninth. So that's another drop. Uh, in the order. All, all we got here, all we got here, right? It's a bigger chance for Sick Boy to screw this up. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we could have yet another generational moment in this chat. Uh, um, later yeah. on into this tournament, uh, if by the time the thirtieth comes uh, goes, that Sick Boy has somehow screwed this up even further. Prediction um, needed for this one. I absolutely agree. Let us do that. We we are we are a casino now. This is not no longer a league racing stream. We're just we're just gambling. Okay, let's Otto go. Said that he's been timed out before, so ban is his next goal. Yes, he has been. Yeah. Okay, choose prediction outcome. Uh, well done to those who uh, believed finally in Enios. DG uh, Yoshi Mario put it all on red. <laughs> 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 okay, let's start a new oh, prediction. Uh, oh God, uh, who's uh, going? This is incredible. Who's who's going? I can't type. Who's going eleventh? Uh... You can put it on the number one pick on just just to remind the gunman of his uh of his yes. painful painful night. Yeah, so we've only been going forty minutes, and it's probably the worst night he's had in a month. Most um... definitely. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna give you guys another minute. Uh, there we go. Prediction is up. Gamble away. Who's going to be picking 11th? Uh, who's going to be picked at 11th? Lock the fun in mobile. 
I, I want to know what Otto is going. Yeah, this uh, is... That uh, way I, 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 <laughs> this is... Do not worry about it. This is the copy pasta that I've been bullied by my Discord server for a long time now. Do not... Do not... Do not pay attention to it. Uh, nah, nah, nah. He's... he's uh, what is it? This is... This is uh, two for two on predictions so far tonight. He's... Uh, Potential for and three for three, and, the, and if we do any for the groups as well. <laughs> the, the thing is, the thing is, uh, also he's won so many times that now now he's dropping straight stacks on these predictions. He's the one coming in with like five k, ten k. He has no fear. He knows he's gonna win. <laughs> uh, oh God. Okay, currently nine thousand got... on Haggerty, one point one thousand on Mobile One. You've got the. Uh groups as well yes i am there is a part of me right that would be completely scared with the scenario but i want a uh a uh beat uh beat pits chat for those who aren't aware to group mm. chat with a few people from the league um i want a beat pits chat group and uh so that'd be me perry uh Capel, and i i guess the other one would be jilt yes um Oh, right, Tap. Yeah, so... sorry. Let me shuffle the wheel. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. This is now rigged now. There we go. You happy? Everyone happy, chat? <laughs> B uh, BG Yoshi Mario. Viewers in your region can only predict without the use of bits. He literally cannot gamble. <laughs> <sighs> also, if I could shuffle again. <laughs> All right, because this is the very important one, let's, let's shuffle again. There we go. <laughs> All right, let's go. Pick number 11. Let's get this wrapped up. This is the final spin of the wheel for the draft lottery because obviously the team that doesn't get picked here goes 12th automatically. So here we go. Haggerty on mobile one. There we go. I just unshuffled this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. This it can't be. It can't be. Oh, it's gonna happen. It can't be. No, no, it's Haggerty. It's yes, yeah. There oh. we go. That was that was a scare there for a second for those with five k plus bets on Agassi, but we go, we we saved it. This, this wheel is no Asseldor is this getting is absolutely no destroyed by these predictions. I don't think he's won <laughs> one of them. Oh, I was free for free. Oh, I was free for free. <laughs> okay, let's get Haggerty on the board and Mobile One at their deserved. Uh, okay, not deserved. Sorry, uh, predicted. Um. Uh, uh, pick number Poor twelve. Cat. He's the only one. He's the only one of the late picks that, like, late late picks that didn't also, uh, yep, <laughs> get a, get a boost. Definitely. Okay, and the uh, final one would be mobile one. Viking wants you to spin for twelve for twelve. <laughs> <laughs> I love how that took, like, the upside of forty minutes, but it was absolutely all worth it. That was. Definitely. That was so much fun. Definitely. Uh, and we're not done yet. We still got group seedings. We're not done yet. Okay. Um, Predict for the groups. Will there be a group of death? <laughs> there we go. So this is our uh, final drafting order. Obviously, just in case, we do have more than 36 available drivers. There will be round number four and it's going to be flipped again. But we're looking at three rounds here. Um, apart from the obvious... Uh, which is the Enio situation, which we're not going to talk about. Uh, what do you think of it? Like, f f obviously, like, are you satisfied with your with your position? I think you are because oh, you jumped up from fifth to fourth. Absolutely. Well, looking at what happened with the rest of the the, the left hand side, the well, yeah, the left hand side of the prediction board of the draft on, yeah. I am more than happy with what happened. It couldn't have got much better. Yeah. <laughs> Give it one for uh, one what one three and uh, one two and four all dropped massive set yes. positions yeah and as 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 I'll point it out only Sparko and Mobile One stayed where they were projected to stay where they're projected yeah. to be so sixth and twelve and with Mobile One with Cap it wasn't really that difficult when you've got from the start one point four percent of getting number one overall pick it's it's it was expected uh but the rest not even in the slightest that was Something yeah. else. That was something else. Admittedly, I think if Haggerty went before Enos, I think the wheel would have had a bit more fun with uh, with Gunman rather than uh, yeah. <laughs> anything else. But Definitely. That is absolutely an incredible list. Um, it's not a list that 
we could have predicted in any shape or form no. because we would have no. just been so wrong. Yes. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let me prepare uh, for the um, uh, group seatings. So I need I need a minute to recover from that. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay. Uh, group seatings. Bear in thing. mind that. While he's doing that, I'll run through what we've got coming up. So we've got the group of seedings coming up. So that will be uh, teams of four, uh, well, groups of four. We'll do A1, B1, C1, and then A2, B2, C, uh, C2, and so forth and so forth. That way there's a little bit of anticipation of who's getting who at what point. Uh, all of the teams on this will be, will, will be weighted equally. So we won't actually get 1.7 or sorry, four point nine percent going first for some godforsaken reason. <laughs> um, so it's an equal chance of who goes where in the groups. We're not waiting that. Uh, and then after the groups, in two weeks' time, we're waiting on pen uh, on confirmation from uh, Keplero, but should be all going well. The thirtieth, I believe that will be the Tuesday, the thirtieth of July. Uh, we will be back here again, but this time. With what eleven other people, we'll be in yes. the group chat. We'll be doing our picks, and we will figure out who's on what team to make sure that Gunman's misery is put in even more. Um, <laughs> mm. uh, so yeah, it should be all going well. The thirtieth of July is the draft, uh, so we'll all be back here seeing everyone uh, make their choices. And then that will spark us properly ready for the actual tournament a couple of weeks after that point. Um, for those, the next tier two cons will be aimed at me. <laughs> <laughs> Lad, you've had four weeks. You, where have you been? I've been killed or I've, I've been hit, knocked off track, spanned, whatever you want to do, whatever name you want to put beside it the entire time. <laughs> Damn, it can't get any worse. Uh, okay, so uh, everything's ready for the group seedings. The one thing, it, like, if we really want to go hard on the gambling, I can only put uh, 10 options in the prediction. So we're not going to be able to do any gambling for the uh, the first two choices. But after that, if you guys really want to stretch it out, if you've got a lot of time, we can do predictions for every single spin. But that's up to you. That's really up to you. Uh, maybe wait for the later picks. But for, for the first two, it's definitely not going to happen. I can't put more than 10 options in the prediction okay uh yeah so as as pyro said we're just gonna go group by group so the team that that we're gonna s select now is gonna go into group a the next one's gonna be group b and so on and so on i am uh, we we have collectively forged a group of people that are addicted to gambling i just glance over to the chat and the first <laughs> thing i see gambling there was no <laughs> yeah i was about i was about to pull on the bg yoshi mario and say that uh uh, please let it be like that. We love gambling. So I assume that means we're doing predictions after the first yes. two. Um, also, <laughs> Matei, uh, to catch you up to speed, uh, first off, you should watch the 30 minutes of the opening part just for laughing at Gun Mad if absolutely nothing else. Yes. Um, but to actually explain, so what we did first is a draft lottery. So we had uh, a formula that was explained at the start. It put out odds that every captain so he has 12 captains and all that uh, every captain had an odd of getting the first pick um, and then we spun a wheel 12 times and that decided the order that we will be going for uh, going through to actually pick the people in two weeks time um, yeah and absolutely go watch it because it is absolute carnage yes um and then go and laugh at Gunman afterwards in chat. Yes. <laughs> that, that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> He's already coming after me for tier two, so I'm going fully down the rabbit hole now. Um... <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, since you guys won gambling, I guess it's going to take a little bit longer, but we still got to get through the first two picks because with the first two uh, selections, we can't do any gambling. It's impossible. So I say we get underway. So this is the team that's going to go first into group A. Let us spin the wheel. Yeah. And let's see what we get. I absolutely don't want to be drawn early here. I want to be drawn, <laughs> quite literally, one of the last three teams because I want to know who I'm getting, not be sat here going, oh, this is going to get so much worse. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay. I would prefer that I would want it early last time. I want late now. And no. it is going to be <laughs> not any else again. Who would have thought? <laughs> I thought it was going to be from it. Now, that was hanging on Enios for a long, long time. Uh, okay. <laughs> but, oh, no, it's going to go to Group A. The first team uh, in Group A uh, is going to be, while I'm having troubles with uh, the, the graphics that I cr created myself, um, um, it's going to be So, Beth, in terms of uh, what teams we're in, I'm in uh, Yokohama. Iggy doesn't have a team. He'll figure out his team in two weeks' uh, time on the 30th of July. Um, as for as for the thing you said, Lord Hans, picking teams after picking groups should make things spicy. This is why we did it this way. Um, we we put the group seedings in with the draft lottery purely because it would be essentially the nicest thing. Um, like it would be added that extra layer, realistically. Yes, definitely. Uh, okay. So with Bill Stein going to Group A, uh, let us um, um, remove it from. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Some people have ads. Yeah. Some people have ads. Why yeah, ads? I, 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 I... Come on, guys. <laughs> Airlaw's gonna make money somehow. You know. <laughs> we already have OnlyFans. We already scam people. We, we don't for for legal purpose of Twitch. We do not do that. I am kidding. Uh, yeah. <laughs> for legal reasons. For legal reasons. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, two out of seven ads that are painful. Ouch! I only got two. <laughs> guys, I understand your complaints, but we've been watching for an hour. This is the best offer i can give you in terms of ads i can't turn them off completely this is this is like well you're gonna watch them now but then for the next hour we're not gonna see them again ever until the next hour rolls around and... i was going to say <laughs> this doesn't go an extra hour in which and if we're doing gambling it might do yes. honestly yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> you might be seeing a little bit more ads uh, the sooner rather than later we'll give it a minute or two to make sure that i'll i will done. make sure that all of the two cents that i earn from these ads i will transfer to the ALR bank account i promise you that guys this is not <laughs> this is not for nothing but yeah no um picking teams after picking groups and that adds to the strategy, right? That that's why we did it. It adds to the strategy. You have to pick around who you're facing. Not only who you're facing in the groups, but obviously your own strengths and everything that goes. So there's so many layers into picking a team. And then obviously the draft lottery itself just went, you know, this common sense thing that we were doing. How about not that? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> It was, it was absolutely incredible. Um, yeah, I, I absolutely. Um... If you missed anything, guys, after this is over, very soon, as soon as I can do it, I will upload this onto the ALI YouTube channel so you can watch the uh, recording there of the whole thing without any ads unless they're YouTube ads. And that is it. I'd say YouTube ads, that's, that's how that works. Yeah, it's definitely going to be YouTube ads. So the few people who got eight ads. <laughs> I, yo. I got, I got two. I was lucky. <laughs> Apparently. This, this is, this is the, uh, uh, since we are on a bit of a break, it is the most annoying part about Twitch because people get random amounts of ads, even though I said, I, I said exactly how much ads they're going to see, but it doesn't matter. All right. Seemingly, the majority is back. Seemingly, so we can continue on, right? You, yeah. You said all. Oh, you said that AOR has an OnlyFans, and now the entire chat is just asking for the link for my OnlyFans. I'm not entirely sure how that's happened. Hey, it's 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 a free shameless plug for you right now. You you can you can promote whatever you want, unless it's gonna get get me banned on Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get back into it. Let's remove Bill Stein because they finally went uh, as the first team in Group A. Let's remove them. And now it's going to be the first team in Group B. So let us spin the wheel. The last team without uh, gambling on it. Yes. <laughs> so uh, we'll see where everyone is going to fall into line for here. As long as it's not me. I want to go late. Oh, it might be any of us. <laughs> so we're going for... Imagine. Imagine. Oh, yes, it is. Imagine. Oh, I'm sorry, Gumbad. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, is it? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. 
Hold on. There are pixels. There are pixels in it. It's not any of those again. It's gold. <laughs> Gunman's just been watching this this arrow just go, yeah, nah. All, yeah. all day, all day. It's going to have absolute nightmares about this uh, about this wheel. Uh, <sighs> but I think it might have been a good thing for him. I don't think he wants to go so early. <laughs> yeah. You kind of um, want to know what you're signing up for. Exactly. Um, well, Perry's in group B, so that's one quarter of the feet picks group. So... <laughs> Okay, now I've got to go do the gambling. Um, yeah. Okay, well, it's going gonna, it's gonna to take a while because uh, I'll have to type all the teams one by one. Uh, okay, what team is going next? You guys are addicts. I'm, I'm just saying. Uh, you know what? I do not remember the teams uh, off the top of my head. Let me let me find... Okay, I've got, I've got the list. Uh, we've got Falcon... We've got Bill Stein. No, wait. Bill Stein went already, right? Bill Stein is. Did, did, did Bill Stein yeah, go? Bill Stein went first. Bill yeah. Stein and Gold went. Okay, so. Um, also, Erotico said, are the draft picks allowed? No, draft picks are not, uh, in fact, allowed. Uh, dra the, trade, the draft pick trades are not allowed uh, because, quite frankly, that would just turn into absolute chaos as if it isn't already chaos but it would turn into unmanageable unmanageable chaos um we're not quite going full nba on this yeah it would be too much we, we had an idea of allowing this but there would be too chaotic it would be too difficult to keep track of and somebody would end up with like literally the top five drivers in in, in the league on their team i love that my my girlfriend and auto are in chat talking about feet picks um, nice. That is exactly what I expected from tonight. Which and Dotto asked which which ALR member has the best beat picks. I will time yeah, you out, also, if you continue that. Okay, uh, I'm gonna give you guys two minutes for this one um, because there's a lot a lot of teams on offer. Uh, Slim, uh, to answer your question, when are the drivers' picks happening? I said it earlier. I don't know if it was caught by people with ads or ever. Um, it will be happening. Provided we get a yes from Kepler o on Tuesday, the 30th of July. It might be 7 or 8, not entirely sure yet, but it will be streamed here again on that day. And we will have, hopefully, everyone in the chat to actually announce their picks. That's the aim. Um, whether or not that happens or not, I guess we'll find out later, closer to the day. But the draft picks will be happening on Oh, well, hopefully happening on the 30th of July in just over two weeks' time. Okay, the prediction is up, everyone. You've got 10 options. So you're, you're, you're going to be pretty spread on this one. And this this has no... Ev like, it's all equal chances. So this is the best representation of actual gambling. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's not the no. Nah, if we go to the casino, they 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 wait that stuff. Come on, we we do as well. No, <laughs> we're, we're not gonna pretend like the Enio <laughs> stuff didn't happen. No, the Enio stuff didn't happen at all. I don't know what you mean. Yeah, fake news, hundred percent. Also, I love how Matei's just been here the entire. Uh, Matei missed the first thirty minutes and has absolutely no idea what's going on. It's yeah. absolutely incredible. Um. It's, I'm just reading Discord chat in the mo in the in the process of all this. And it's just quite funny to uh to, Whoever, to see him. Whoever dropped five thousand on Castrol, you're either the smartest oh, or the stupidest oh, man alive. It's, <laughs> it's, 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 it's gotta auto. be it's gotta be. Okay, yeah, who, who else okay, would it be? <laughs> <laughs> well he's going for four for four, so I guess that's what the four K symbolizes. Um <sighs> If he wins, he's not even going to win more than, what, 500 coins? So he bet almost 5,000 to potentially win four or 500. Go big or go home, Mickey. Come on. I agree, though. <laughs> I agree with that, yeah. All right, the prediction is almost <laughs> over. We if say it's... that like he has already put 10k. <laughs> one of them fell earlier on. Also, uh, Viking just said, if Otto gets it right, he's muting him for 10 minutes. That's entirely fair. <laughs> this man's got to be cheating at this point. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's spin the wheel. Let's see who's right. Let's see what team is going to go to group number C.
Group number C, what am I saying? It's a group C. Tap said thank you. <laughs> uh, Tap said thank you for your coins, Auto. If that actually lands on Castro now, Tap's going to look like a right idiot. <laughs> hey, it's not going to land on Castro. Say goodbye to your coins, Auto. Because it looks like Falcon <laughs> is going to group C, yes. Okay, so off of A1, A2, uh, A1, B1, and C1, uh, it's Dracus, Auto, or Perry. Okay, so the potential for a group of death realistically only lies with Group B now. So far, yes. Uh, let's update that. There we go. Th this one's going to stretch out chat because unless someone in uh, some mod in the chat can do the payouts, I'm going to have to do it myself. Uh, Falcon, there we go. Uh, and I'm going to have to go away from this screen every single time I do that, but it's fine. Uh, okay, Falcon. Did somebody bet on Falcon? Somebody did. 50 coins. Congratulations. I just got a ton of coins. Yes, there we go. Whoever that was, congratulations. I've only bet that... <laughs> they, oh, it's Moose. It was Moose. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Only 50 coins, though. Damn. Yeah, but Auto just put five grand on. Yeah, you on you, cash you, on, you won so. everything that was put in there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> like, you just won like 5k coins. Calm down. <laughs> okay, another one. Let's go. Let's go, chat. Gambling. Watch Ooh, Moose. funny. Now watch Moose put 5k on it. He's not the um, auto is now not the only big wig in chat. I, I like how at this point, I'm pretty sure the only person who actually cares about the actual groups is you. Everybody else just, eh, eh, gambling, eh, funny. <laughs> <laughs> well, I reckon the other captains might actually give a crap about yeah. where they go. <laughs> uh, okay, there's another prediction. You got about like one and a half minutes. Uh... To, to do that because we're going to be selecting the team for group number A. So who is going to partner? Well, not really partner, but go against Bill Stein in group number A. I love how it's just group number A now. We, we're group going number, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, group number A. <laughs> it, that's it. We've lost it. We've lost all control of this stream. <laughs> Tap, what do you want me to shuffle? Okay, fine. I will shuffle. Oh, no. Nothing changed. <laughs> But okay, fair, fair. I did say I will shuffle, even though the odds are exactly the same. I will shuffle. Thank you. Asador um, said, "Not Group B. He doesn't want to sweat from the start." So I want to, I want to put a preface in this. So how the groups work for those who aren't uh, clued up, it will be the top. So the top two, the four teams in a group, the top two at the end of four days of racing. Those four days have already been announced, if you've been in chat. Um, the top two from four days of racing will go straight through um, to the... Is it semi-finals? Yeah, semi-finals, yeah. Semi yep. um, and then the bottom two from each group will go into last chance races, which will happen the following Saturday, then the next race that will be announced on Friday. Yeah, six days' time. Um, yeah, and then you've got a uh, essentially the top two from those. Oh, I can't, I... <laughs> yeah, so the third, the two. the third and fourth places from each group will go into the last chance race, and the top two from those uh, in the last chance will go into the semi-final. So if you don't immediately make it in the group, if you ended up in the group of death, you still have a chance of making it through. Uh, through the uh, last chance race, so it's not over. If you end up in a in a group of death, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Uh, but now, with the predictions finally set, let's go see who's going to be with Bill Stein in Group A. I almost said Group Number A, number a again, but at this point, it's it's, it's well, whatever. We've lost control of this. Group. Yeah, it's yeah, it's <laughs> over. It happens. It happens. All right, let us oh, see. This is great. I'm hoping it's not me. I want to go in the last three. I want to know what I'm going against. Oh, it might be you. No, it's not. Oh, it might be you though. Oh. No. It's Adios. Actually, uh, not no, lost. Yes. 
There we go. Okay, so I don't think Gunman will be too disappointed with this because he's in a group right now yeah. with someone else who also tanked down the list. Yeah, yeah. In terms of the people actually picking. Yes. So, um, I, I think Gunman will be slightly happier that he was about 20 minutes ago. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> um... Because there may be, depending obviously on who gets there, uh, there may be a chance of making fit through that group. Also, uh, Asseldor made 4k off of that um, for any of us going nice. into group A. Uh, you also, know what? My girlfriend asked if... Yeah, go on, sorry. sorry um... <laughs> Every time. And my girlfriend asked uh, if she gets to do the spreadsheets for standings, so she did that for Nations Cup. I mean, we're not going to say no to more help. Uh, I'm not even going to hide the screen now. You're just going to see this uh, while I uh, pay out the predictions. Uh, oh, did somebody play them out? Oh, somebody played them out. Thank you. I don't know who did, but... It'll be Thank Viking, you. I'm guessing. Thank you. Yeah, appreciate it. Uh, but let's start the next prediction. Now we're going to remove the um, Enios from the list. Only eight options now. Uh, I'm going to give you guys one minute now. So we, we speed this up a little bit. There's less options. You should be able to read through eight lines of text pretty quickly. Um, there we go. One minute Excellent for Viking. the next team. Thank you, Viking. Yeah, Appreciate it. Yeah, it was Viking that made it out. That's, that's kind. Um, yeah, so, uh, not only that, while well, we've got the minute, um, before the predictions. Yep. What is, who's, who, what's your prediction? Where, who's coming into, uh, Group B with Perry? And Ooh, I don't know, but, but, I kind of want the Group B uh, to turn into the group of death now. So it would be nice to get someone like CMP in there, so Alpine Stars. That will be that will be that will be <laughs> one hell of a group. That was funny enough. Where I was going with this, uh, oh, I nice. wanted it to be CMP. Uh, CMP or so Alpine Stars or Penzoil. That's yeah. That's what I want uh, to go result from this. Alpine Stars, Penzoil, and then Mobile One. And this is this is the group. This is not even the group of death. This is the group of non-existence. Like, this is just a straight fight to death every single race. Shuffle? Yes, I will <laughs> shuffle. Sorry, there's the shuffle. There we go. The only issue is this... So not... Oh my god, I just said not Pyro if you want a group of death. Yeah, no, not me. And quite frankly, I don't want to be part of it. <laughs> <laughs> I, if anything, I would take just going, I don't know, for group A at this point. I would I would gladly go into group A. <laughs> I would feel extremely confident going into that group right now. Good news, every single team has coins on them. So someone is gonna win coins, which is always nice. Alright, let's go. Next spin. Group B, team two. Let's see who is going there. Who's gonna join golf? Yeah, after that, but I might I might uh, put myself in a wall, but I can draft a team of people who won't do that exact thing. Hmm. <laughs> oh, 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 is it, oh, is it happening? It's gonna happen. Oh, it's definitely it's happening. It's gonna happen. Hundred, it's, it's got it's to. Gonna happen. No, I don't, is it? it? It is, it is, yeah, yeah, it's stopping. It is. There it we is. go. It's gonna happen. Mobile <laughs> one. The group of death is beginning right in front of our eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Perry, oh, oh, Moose King's won again. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Moose King's won again. Perry and Keplero in the same group. I now don't want to be in Group B <laughs> if I can avoid it. Yeah, now we get into I a point where you can actually fight. see what group you want to avoid. You, you like you, you hope <laughs> you're not gonna be there. Well, Kep, just put in chat hashtag ring. Well, <laughs> given the fact that you're here, Kep, can you do the 30th? Uh, you know, given the fact that we need that to confirm whether or not we can actually run the draft on the 30th. Okay, we're removing uh, Mobile 1 from the prediction. One minute again. Let's go, chat. Get your coins in. Seeing if uh, Kep's gonna respond. Yep. I think he's typing. So we might get a 
might get a confirmed date on. Uh, That'll be great. On chat on stream. I keep again. I'm in about 100 different Discord servers, so I look over whenever <laughs> I go. The notification is not the it's not the one I want it to be right now. All right, everyone. Less than 30 seconds left on the prediction. There we go. Fan attack has no selections, and Penzoil no selection. So if it lands on those two, everyone loses their coins. Yeah. Uh, Kep said uh, he doesn't have Twitch, but it's still on the show. And but considering it's the only day you have, I guess so. All right. That's fair. By the way, Twitch can work in in the browser, just so you know. Um, this is this is unfair. Gun mad and girl, my, gun mad and my girlfriend to speak English are just going after me now. Gun mad wants them so he can communicate. I spent a lot of time, uh, crash <laughs> and uh, my girlfriend wants you to do a stream on my birthday, just reacting to my spins. <laughs> you know what? I will <laughs> gladly do it. It will be an honor. Oh, God, so. <laughs> <laughs> 31st of August. <laughs> uh, all right. We'll keep that in mind for future. Now, uh, second team, A Group C. Who's going to join Falcon? Who's who's the captain of Falcon? Uh, Fracas, right? Yeah. Who's going to join Fracas uh, in Group C? Let us find out. Now I'm hoping that it's not Pennzoil or Alpine Stars. Or Cap Stroll. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's not Yokohama. It might be Alpine Stars or Pennzoil. Oh, that's not good. It's well, Alpine the group Stars. of death's dead. Oh, really? There's still Castrol and Pennzoil. Yeah, true. Okay, Alpine well, Stars. Well, there goes... Uh, Fracas, we're sorry in advance. You got dropped down the Detroit Pistons style, and now you've got the guy yep. who took your number one pick. <laughs> 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 uh... Not to beat you over a chair over the head with a chair a little bit more, but yeah, good luck. You're, you're gonna need it. Auto one. Ah, oh, god. Oh, again. <laughs> Alpine stars going to group C. There we go. I just want group A. That's all I want. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank I you for the want payout. Anything else? Remove. We down to six teams. Uh, let's start the prediction. Yeah, I don't I don't want anything else at this point. Just put me in group A. That way I can have a little bit of an easy run to the <laughs> final. Or oh, the semi-final, sorry. Alpine stars are off. Start the prediction. There we go. One minute. Go, everyone. Now, so we're starting the, the third round. Group A. And so far, group A... And again, we're obviously judging only based on the captain's rating. Obviously, they could draft an insane team, 100%. But so far, Group A is looking like a slightly easier group than others. Who do you think is going to land in Group A as a third team? I'm hoping it's me. Um, <laughs> well, obviously, yeah. <laughs> um, no, honestly, I think it'll be cast. Uh, okay. Gunman said, if, if I get drawn into Group A, he will take the penalty points just to for me <laughs> fair enough <laughs> that, that's just mean just mean i have make sure that i am nowhere near you then got mad <laughs> <laughs> people who I'm are watching this later on door. youtube are missing out on some great action by the way <laughs> and i'm actually I'm, I'm thinking people are running out of coins because the, 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 there's less and less bets on these teams now <laughs> oh People wanted to gamble that didn't have the balls to gamble. Yes, yeah. You, you've <laughs> got to commit to the bit, chat. You've got to gamble away. Once you start, you can't stop. You can't. Oh, for legal reasons, you can't. You shouldn't gamble in the first place. Unless it's pretend <laughs> internet coins, then gamble away. Okay. Uh, group A, <laughs> Team 3, Shuffle. Sorry, forgot to shuffle. Now shuffled, and now we spin. Ninety percent of gamblers. Yes, just reading for a big win. <laughs> All right, let's see. It's not Yokohama, uh, not Pennzoil, not Castrol. Can it be Fanatec? It's gonna be Charitech, isn't it? It's gonna be Fanatec. We are gonna have the whipping boys in Group A and then <laughs> everyone else. 
It is. It's fan attack. It's it is Charizard. fan attack. Woo! It's Charizard, Gunnard, and Auto in the same group. <laughs> this is the group of death. The real one. So that means someone from Group A that we may have penned out as potentially going to go out in the group stage and be done with it uh, is guaranteed a place in the semi-final. Yes. Wow. One of the... So, uh, one of the... Well, three of the four that uh, had top picks in the same group. Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, predicted top picks. Yeah. They don't have but they were predicted them. Okay, what team just <laughs> went? It was, it, was, uh, it was Fan Attack, right? Fan Attack. Fan Attack is off the board. There we go. Five options left. One minute. Gambling. Go. I am extremely fearful that this is going to be me. <laughs> All right. We are. Yeah, we might be filling out Group B, a.k.a. Group of Death right now. The question is, how deadly is it going to be? Because at this point, I at this point. I want to say. Yeah. I just want to say, I'm the worst driver on that, that board left. <laughs> well, statistically. I'm not even joking. Speaking. Asseldor has, I'm pretty sure, won a tier 2 race. Sick Boy is tier 1 and has been in tier 1 before. Yeah. Jilt is currently in tier 1. And Kapale just ended up on a podium in tier 1. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I am the worst one. I to go to Group B as a self-fulfilling prophecy. No, you, no, you, know, you, you know what? You know what? If you do go to Group B, uh, you deserve it uh, for the Enios <laughs> situation. <laughs> I don't because I'm not a captain. I might still end up in that group, but you do. <laughs> so if if you go right now to Group B, if Yokohama goes to Group B, uh, did you did no one bet on this prediction? Hold on, guys. Oh no, never mind. Never mind. Okay, I sorry. Yeah, I apologize. It's just something else came up. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's see. Uh, how deadly is Group of Death going to be? Uh, group B. Hopefully team really number deadly, because it won't be me. Yes. <laughs> I'm just over, holding on to a prayer right now. There are a lot of bets on Yokohama. Oh, it might be. It's either going to be Sparko or Yokohama, and it is going to be Sparko, yeah. It's Sparko. Oh, I saw the... He's already responding. He is... Oh, Matei's hit big, apparently. All right. Matei has hit big on Asseldon's misery. Sparko going to Group B. I would like to point out, right, that yep. Group A at this current time doesn't have a driver above Tier 3. Oh, what, what a hell of a group. I really want to be there. <laughs> My favorite group. Yeah, I really hope somebody drafts me in one of those teams. <laughs> group B, right, has current Tier 2 leader, a current Tier 2 race winner, and tier one cap. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and that is very unfortunate for the Helsing Group B. I just want to point out the difference in the groups here. <laughs> yes. We are basically forming new tiers. This is not this is not groups anymore, this is just tiers. <laughs> uh, okay. Bearing in mind, I would like to point out that no one in group B has a higher pick than sixth. It's sixth. I think 6th, 8th, and 12th for picks in Group B. Mm -hmm. In Group A, it is 2nd, 2nd, 6th, and 10th, yep. I believe. Oh, no, 7th and 10th, sorry, because yeah. I dropped 5. Uh, and then it's 1 and four, uh, one and 5 in Group C. So yeah. that's... That, okay. That's the uh, kind of thing we're going into. Gambling is up. Oh, of course you guys know. There's already thousands of coins on these teams. I'm not surprised in the slightest. Asseldor said he must be the most unlucky man in ALR at the moment. <laughs> you cannot <laughs> claim that after what happened to Gunmad. You cannot. <laughs> I was about to say, we've just proved how unlucky Gunmad is about 30 minutes ago. Yeah. Oh, shuffle. Apologize. Shuffle. Shuffle. There we go. All right, the prediction the fact that is over. Was, 
Matei wanted uh, Asseldorf to draft him at the beginning of the night, by the way. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Not uh, sure yeah. he wants that anymore. Yeah, you, you sure you <laughs> want to do it? <laughs> okay, third team to Group C with four teams left on the board. Let's go. Now, I wouldn't complain with this being me. It's not the easiest group, but I wouldn't be complaining if this was my It's name. definitely better than Group B, 100%. Oh, comfortably. Comfortably. But again, everything could change with the picks that the captains make. And it's actually not going to be Yokohama. It's not going to be you. It is going to be Castrol. No. Oh. We do have Jill going to Group C with his future team. So that's Tier 1 Jill. Um, Tier 1 CMP with the first pick. And Fracas. <laughs> I like how you just listed like titles of those people, achievements, and then just, and fracas. <laughs> I wanted to point out how screwed fracas is. <laughs> yes, he most definitely is. <laughs> okay. I am absolutely praying, just for the sake of a tier of multiple groups of death, that my name is the next one out the hat. <laughs> because if my name is the next one out the hat, by the way. Group B will get Capel or Sick Boy, and Group C will get the other. <laughs> oh, okay. If uh. I'm, I'm curious, right? If a tier one, if Capel, for example, goes into Group C, mm -hmm. what is the wor what? Which one's the worst group? Because there's three tier one drivers as captains in Group C if Capel actually... or Capel or Sick. Into that. Actually, that is a good point. We might actually start. We, we group C looks like the new group of death. It, it it looks like actually that it's not the case of there being a group of death. It's rather being a group of a vacation, which is group A. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. we still we still gotta wait and see who ends up in the last team to form group A. Uh, so we are in the final Come round on. of our of Come our on, group maybe. seedings. Maybe. I want to see the rigs if it's me. <laughs> <laughs> I want it. I want to see it. I want to see the meltdown. Oh, so someone is going to be very happy if it's actually you, because Yokohama currently has 3% of the predictions with only 210 uh, coins on it, with a total of more than 7,000, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> okay. Most They'll be happy, but honestly, I think I might be happier. Yes, definitely. I get a fourth pick, and I get the vacation group. <laughs> oh, oh, almost, almost forgot. Shuffle. There we go. Switch Penzoil and Haggerty around. So it's all fair. I swear to God, if it's if this is Capel, third <laughs> pick against that group, I'm gonna, I'm gonna absolutely all right. lose my goddamn mind. Final round of the group seedings. We are gonna see how Group A looks. What team is gonna complete Group A? Here we go. Come on, come on. Come on, be red, be red. You know you wanna. So it's two tier one drivers, one tier two driver. That, oh, I've got no, bad news, Pyro. I've got bad news. That's not gonna be me. Oh no! It's but Capel. who is it? It is Capel. And oh, Penzoil. He's, just... he's got pick number three and that group. That is insane. Well, group. We don't have to. We don't have to go. We don't have to. We, that group doesn't have to race at this point. Have to <laughs> on that group. But you never know. Obviously, we are judging on the captains, but he he could potentially draft the worst possible team. He could completely flop on this. So yes, yeah, so far I mean, it looks obvious, but you never know. He could, in theory. Yes, he could. However, he's got pick three. Oh so yes, theory, I forgot about it. Yeah, draft, you should be drafting one of the quicker ones, and he literally could just run it as a two-man team and probably still make it. <laughs> yes, definitely. <laughs> okay, final prediction, the big one. I'm gonna give you guys uh, two oh. minutes for this one. Who is going to go oh. to Group B? Yokohama or Haggerty? Pyro or Sick Boy? There we go. Two minutes Gunman's to gamble. Saying he's... Gun... Gunman's saying he's screwed. I'm not sure you are. <laughs> I'm really not sure you are in that group. Auto, I mean, Auto and Charizard, they didn't exactly 
menacing competition. No offense, Arthur. <laughs> um, <laughs> actually, that's a lie. All offense. Uh, um, I think you've got a chance. I don't know which one I'd rather have. The two tier twos or the two tier ones. I, I, I think I'm go- I kind of want to be in B at this point in time. Because it's two tier twos. I'd have the highest pick in that group. And kept the tier one guy and he's picking 12. I think I might want to be in that group. I know this is not really what we're doing here. But this prediction, the racks on racks on racks. We are looking at almost oh, 20,000 coins in, like, total bets. <laughs> I know Otto uh, put eight grand, on, eight grand on me. <laughs> we, are, we are over 20,000. There are going to be some tears after this prediction. I'm telling you that right oh, now. <laughs> I'm, I am so... I don't know whether or not I want to be in with the tier ones or the tier twos. Yeah, this is like th- this is what I want to talk about while we'll wait for the prediction to be over, uh, which is almost 50-50 split. Uh, where do you want to be? Like, where is your mind right now? You have an option. Well, basically, there's two, two death groups. Just pick your poison. <laughs> <laughs> I think just going off of the picks of group B, so 6, mm-hmm. 8, 12. Yeah. Given that I'm pick 4, I think... I, I, I think I've got to want to go into Group B because I don't want to be facing a CMP with first pick. So that would be CMP and BX in that team. Yeah. And I don't want to be facing Gilves with whoever he gets. That is a great uh, So just by the idea of I might be able to scan my way through this group, I think this I want this to be me. Yeah. <laughs> I, I see the vision. I'm just looking at it. Maybe I come second in the group. I get a decent pick. I get a decent drive. I come second in the group. Right. I'm not complaining. I don't have to rate the extra race. And yeah, that's a good point. I made it through, but there's no, there, there's no hope in hell in coming to first or second in that group C. Mm-hmm. I hope, I hope, send sick boy to them. Send sick boy to them right now. <laughs> just, <laughs> just, just to be completely fair, let's give it a good shuffle, a good couple of shuffles. I'm shuffling. There we go. I've shuffled like 20 times. We're good to 58% go. 58% Yokohama, 42% Haggerty. I want to see. There's almost twenty four thousand in the pot total. Almost a fifty fifty split. More people, uh, a lot more people voted for Haggerty, but the coins amount is almost fifty fifty split. All right, let's find out. This is a chat. This is the final one. What team is gonna go to Group B and what team is gonna go to Group C? What whatever team is picked now, going to Group B. Let's go. I answer your question, but if the top two from each group get guaranteed to the semi-finals, uh, the third and fourth place in each group will go into uh, a last chance race on the follow- on the following Saturday. And it is. Yeah, oh, is it? Is it Yokohama though? Is it though? Is it though? It's getting close. It is very close. It is Yokohama. Is it? Okay. Yes, yes, it is. Yokohama to Group B confirmed. I don't like. I absolutely don't. I do not like. Diamond Group B. <laughs> but I do like the fact that it's not the Group of Death. Yes. <laughs> that very much goes to Group C. I am sorry in advance, Fracas. <laughs> yeah. That is. You are. <laughs> without even like even now without their teams without their picks this is just the the t- the group sorry to avoid <laughs> there TMP's we go he's got the best pick i'm glad i avoid that situation <laughs> did auto win again he did yeah did it, it of course obviously <laughs> obviously the only person in the world he to actually m- make coins out of gambling <laughs> Uh, okay well uh, that is uh basically it so these are the groups um arguably gr- group a is relatively easy for capel uh but obviously depends on oh he is picking high as well isn't he <laughs> he's so, got third pick he's got he third pick love yeah. that group. <laughs> so ideal like probably most likely group a is fighting for who's not going to go to the last chance race 
this is the realistic battle for those in Group A, I think. Um, because P1 is almost locked in for Penzoil, but you never know how it's going to go down. Uh, group B, a very interesting group. This is probably the most balanced group, because you, we do have you, for example, who's the lowest rated captain out of this group, but you do have the highest pick out of these, these teams. So that's definitely going to play exactly into your favor. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, me it's meant to balance it out. Yeah, uh, that's what I said. Group B is uh, tier two plus Cap, and Cap gets pick twelve. So <laughs> it's not like Cap has a massive advantage over the rest of us. So yes, definitely. there's a lot that's going through. Anybody can pick anybody off on that day, depending on who um, on the thirtieth, who's on what team. Um, I would like to point out going back to Group A real quick. Fanatec pick second. Yeah. So there is a possibility that you're going to go into that group and have to fight Capel. Ah, right. I forgot about it. Um, I forgot that I even <laughs> I'm driving in this. I'm just sitting here, not even uh, any worries about where I could possibly go. So that is a very good point, yes. <laughs> you're looking at this, right, uh, from your point of view. Yeah. Pick one is pick one is in group C, which if you get to go pick group one, uh, pick one, sorry, good luck. Yes. Um, <laughs> if you get if you don't get picked, uh, pick one and pick, get dropped to two or three, then you're you're looking pretty pretty nicely there, I think. <laughs> yes. Yeah. We do have a very nice split of groups. So we have Group A, which is a group of vacation. We call it, I think. Group B, which is a group of okay, and then Group C, which is you know that meme that Viking sent when there's like. Uh, atomic bomb versus coughing baby <laughs> and group C is just atomic bomb atomic bomb atomic bomb and the coughing baby <laughs> I'm sorry yeah. but it yeah. just reminded me of that uh, but um, you know you know what the funny thing is right you know what makes this a thousand times funnier so we yeah. we came into event chat right before this yeah uh, and Frack has said he could only be here for one hour oh yes that hour Last until the end of the lottery. So he's seen himself get fifth pick. Which means when he comes back to this later on when it goes up on the YouTube channel. Yes. That's what he's going to be stared down by. <laughs> he doesn't know that he's a coughing baby in his group. <laughs> oh, man. That is something else. All right. Before we wrap this up, let's go take a look at the draft order uh, again. If it wants to switch. My computer is on this last legs doing this. Did it actually switch the scene? I don't think it's... Oh, no, it did. It did. It did. It did. Let's just do this. There we go. Uh, once it updates, there we go. These are the picks. Uh, we do have quite a shuffle, but Alpine Stars going 1st, 24th, and 25th. Fan Attack 2, 24, 26. Uh, Penzoil, a surprise, a very surprise jump uh, all the way to 3rd. And then 22nd and 27th, Yokohama, also another jump. Congratulations, Pyro. Uh, fourth, 21st, and 28th. Uh, Falcon at 5, uh, and then 20 and 29th, Sparkle. The first of two teams who actually stayed where they were projected to stay, uh, with 6, 19, and 30. Uh, Bilstein, with quite a big drop, but not as big of a drop as we're going to get to in a second. So Bilstein with uh, 7, 18, and 31, Golf. Uh, another small drop from P7 or P6? Um, P7. P7, yeah. Uh, with 8, 17, and 32. Then Castrol with 9, um, 16, and 33. Then Enios. The tragedy of this draft lottery. From 4th all the way down to 10th. Uh, 15th, which isn't that bad. A small, a small gap between your first and second pick. Uh, and then uh, 34th, which is all the way at the end, and then Haggerty, 11, 14, and 35, and wrapping up the list is Mobile 1 with 12, 13th, back-to-back -back picks, which is actually quite a big advantage, 12, 13, and then all the way at the end at 36. So, this is how things are going to go down on uh, July 30th, which is in uh, two weeks' time. Uh, is it? Yeah, it's almost two weeks. Just over. A, a bit Just more, over. yeah. yeah. Uh, when we actually going to, when the captains are actually going to pick their teams. And ideally, it's not only going to be two of us. It is going to be 13 of us with 12, yeah, uh, 11 other captains. Pyro is a captain. Uh, yeah, should be quite fun. I don't know 
if there's any gambling possible for the actual draft. Uh, but we'll see oh, about absolutely. it. <laughs> absolutely. Because the picks are going to be... The picks are going to... If you're not ready anyway, the picks are going to take some time. So you might yes. be able to put some gambling on who each captain is going to pick. Yeah, you but might, there's like 36 pick. people available. I can uh, only put 10 options. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but we know realistically who going to go where or whereabouts. Oh, CMP anyway. just showed up. Welcome to the number one overall pick, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> Hopefully you're happy. I'm sure you are. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, the plan going forward is that from now on, captains are going to start working at who they actually want to pick, uh, come up with a short list uh, of the drivers that they want to pick for their teams based on when they're picking and what group they're going to go to. And then, uh, on 30th of July, most likely, it's not set fully yet, but most likely, on 30th of July, we're going to meet here again uh, for the full draft of the Airline Champions Cup. And the actual event itself is happening between uh, 15th and 29th of August. If you're not in the league and you want to join, there's a QR code, very handy, uh, positioned all the way uh, at the bottom left corner. And if you are in the league, but you want to join in, uh message us me pyro anyone mention us and we're gonna get you in uh to the list the captain thing position is not gonna happen unfortunately it's already set uh but as a driver everyone is uh more than welcome yeah yeah Every, it, it's uh it's gonna be a fun time on the 30th i am 100 so looking forward 100 percent and if you missed any of the streams, do not worry. It will go up on the ALR YouTube channel very, very soon. As soon as I download this and upload it onto uh, the ALR channel, it's going to be there. So don't worry if you missed anything. And if you did miss something, definitely go watch it back. It was probably one of the best things I've ever done <laughs> so far in terms of league racing. <laughs> and it's not even racing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be an hour, an hour and 40 minutes long, and it's just going to be everyone just descending into chaos for an hour and yes, 40 minutes absolutely honestly it went a lot better than i thought it was gonna go yeah uh, i mean I, I, yeah. I, I completely agree 100 percent. but yeah thank you everyone I, for watching thank you for sticking around uh we will see you very soon most likely on 30th and yeah thank you for sticking around you are amazing never forget about it and we will see you very soon Boop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>